Hey guys, Fadi just let you know some good news here uh, for you Apple TV owners and it's the Apple TV 2 I'm talking about, not the new Apple TV 3. This is just, as I said, for Apple TV 2 uh, running on the new updated iOS 5.0 or iOS 5.1. You can now go ahead and jailbreak that using Season Pass, the new version uh, that's out right now, the 0.8.3 that's also coming with uh, the Apple TV. TV, a new flash of that that costs like 29 bucks it's version 1.4.1 and you get some extra things with that but it, it costs money but the jailbreak doesn't cost money and you can go ahead and see here some things that works uh, lost.fm works a uh, couch surfer different plugins here rss feeds night of tv media player maintenance weather works some other that doesn't work is this uh, popular media center app application xbmc doesn't work right now remote hd plex overflow remote doesn't work now i should say myself i don't own an apple tv so um, i'm pretty sure what the deal is uh, but uh, maybe I, maybe i'm gonna buy it in the future i'm not sure but it's not available for apple tv 3 at the moment but if you're running on the apple tv 2 you can go ahead and jailbreak ios uh, 5.1 on it so that's awesome it's also tethered but as we do know the apple tv doesn't come with the battery so you will rarely need to reboot it but when you are going to reboot your new or i mean your apple tv you need to go ahead and like plug it into your computer and redo the jailbreak and that's uh, why it's called tethered so hopefully they will unveil a untethered variant pretty soon you can see some pictures here i think you can i mean change the icons and do some other crazy stuff and of course you do have this ATV flash which costs a little bit of money but then you will get some extra things yeah see you.